Third, for team awareness, is communication. And just know that as leaders, we're always communicating. Even when you're not saying anything, you're communicating. And I'm not just talking about your nonverbals. I'm not just talking about, you know, facial expressions and body language and posture and tonality. I'm also talking about the unconscious messages that underpin every single thing we say and every single thing we do. And we have to take control of those unconscious messages. The best example I can think of is delegation. In order for you all to continue to thrive as leaders, you have to get good at the art of delegating. If not, you become the bottleneck in every single aspect of your firm. When you delegate something of importance to a teammate and you ask a teammate for help, what's the unconscious message you send them? Yeah, I trust you. I believe in you. I think you're good enough. That's why I asked for your help. That type of unconscious message will strengthen your relationship with that person. What happens if you delegate something and then you micromanage. You either literally or figuratively stand over their shoulder, breathing down their neck, making sure they cross every T and dot every I. What's the unconscious message you send then? Yeah, it's the exact opposite. I don't trust you, I don't believe in you, I don't think you're good enough to get this done, that's why I'm standing here. Now I know that is not what you mean. I know that is not what's in your heart. I know that is not what you intend. But for those of you taking notes, write this down. This is one of the most powerful coaching aphorisms I learned very early in my career. And that is, it's not what you say, it's what they hear that matters. You say I need your help, but when you micromanage, what they hear is Alan doesn't trust me, Alan doesn't believe in me, Alan doesn't think I'm good enough to get this done. And unfortunately, that type of unconscious message will erode your connection and relationship with that person. It's like pulling a thread out of a sweater. And when it comes to these aspects of team awareness, our role clarity, accountability, and communication, don't ever forget that little things, especially done consistently, make a huge difference. 